Yo, what's good guys? Today's video is pretty special because it's sponsored by Battle for 2042. Definitely a pretty surreal sponsorship. It really doesn't get much more real than being sponsored by the very game that you're already playing. Anyways, 2042 has recently dropped Season 3 and I've been having a lot of fun playing it, especially on the new map Spearhead. I've added a new specialist, Rashid Zayn. He's got a really handy perk where he regens health on kill, along with an airburst rifle which is useful for getting people off rooftops and behind cover. They've also added a bunch of new weapons including the Rorsch Mark IV Railgun, the MVK S22 Smart Shotgun, the MVK P125 Bullpup Pistol, and the Throwing Knives. Now out of everything I've added, my favourite thing is definitely the Rorsch Mark IV Railgun. It's just really really fun just tapping on all those heads at long range, pretty much no matter how far away you are. If you put your crosshair on the head, you're probably going to get the kill. Now there is also the Tor Rail Tank. Yeah, this thing just lives rent free in my nightmares, I'm not even going to lie. I think I might have to give up. Anyways, if you haven't tried the game already, it's going to be free to play on PlayStation from the 16th to 23rd of December. Alternatively, if you're on Xbox or PC, it's on both Xbox Game Pass and EA Play, so it's pretty easy to give it a go. Anyways, what does Season 3 actually play like? Whew. Bit of sharp aim. Ah! Oh, oh, no, 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 no. So you can, you can take care of air vehicles, if I can show you that. So there's like a jet there. And, um, kill anyone at any range with the railgun. I'm a bit rusty, but I'll get there. And I can heal myself. Like, how can you go wrong? It's, it's literally a super soldier. Back around the corner here. Oh, okay. So I'm gonna play this corner. Like, corners are a sign guard I actually, like, reinforce my knowledge about by playing Overwatch again. And they really do apply to flying in this game. Well, cover in general, but, like, using corners is quite clutch. Oh, there you go. Alright. So, we got that. The combo to do, use is the tow missile and then the bombs. Using that, you can like pretty much instantly knock out vehicles. <laughs> the only issue is if someone on the other team pulls out a TV missile, it's very hard to survive. It just is. Because there's not many like decent combined arms games that come out these days. <laughs> and then with the vertical beam, if I get hit one of those bombs, I'm gonna try. Yeah, I thought the railgun was actually going to break the game entirely, but I think the charge up time makes it so a lot of players just don't want to use it. Using a prone LMG playstyle. Oh. I give up. <laughs> Cut my losses, mate. Oh my god, parachuters. Oh, friendly ones there. Like that, that's, a, that's literally on his head. I didn't have to lead that at all. I think there's a drone spotting. Yeah, it has bombs, like, do you know that? I should probably say no, shouldn't I? Oh my god. Oh, the hit marker sound is different, what the hell? Ding, 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 ding. Toe! Wait, that, that splash damage him, okay. <laughs> there you go. Alright, uh, another, another bombing run on the hill. Let's go. Let's go. All around here. You beauty, mate. You beauty. I think there's a rail tank somewhere. I'm a bit scared, but... Oh, farm. Get the farm. <laughs> farm. Screw the rail tank. Get the farm. No. Nah. God damn it, rail. This, this top roof section is really good to hide at. I hit my shots, I should be able to get this guy. There we go. <laughs> oh no, dude! Alright, I'm gonna put stealth mode on. I'm going to go for a big bombing run on this hill. 
Oh. Oh, he's here. Get him, get him, get him. <laughs> yeah, get him. Let's go. Nice feet. Thank you, man. Thank nice you. Feet. You got the picks that they came through, I guess, then. Right? Right on time. Yeah, free shit, that Woods. How you doing, man? You lift 25 tons today? He is here a bit. I, I, I smell problem. Hmm. It is a an absolute hall of fame level tactic. Flying over the AA. This is such a good spot here. Because everyone I need to kill is in range. Right, probably someone here. Well, he got here. Oh, oh. Like, I had like five TVs being shot at me, and the Irish APS was just eating them all. Oh, nice shot. Nice shot. Alright, that's, uh, that's the first life of the kill race. He's been farming. Rail tank at the back of the map. Classic. Is NA already filled with rail tanks sitting at the back of the map like OC is? Yeah, that is a, just absolutely brilliant sportsmanship in the kill race. I just love killing helicopters with a sniper rifle. It just, it's, something's funny about it. it doesn't make sense. There's some more of the boys gaming that we can indulge in. And as long as you got some meme strats to go with it, then you can't really go wrong, honestly. Yeah, this map is, like, like, I have no, bro. Okay, so th this is the kind of player I am. Back in Battlefield 4, my first probably, um, maybe... 500 hours of playing properly, like actually trying to get good at the game, was on a 24-7 Parasol server. I just played Parasol Storm. I wouldn't touch any other maps unless Parasol wasn't, like, populated. <laughs> Reaps would play on that server a lot as well. He also loved it. Reaps would be in the heli and I'd be in the jet and we'd just farm everything. Like five years ago, this was. That's how I met Nispel as well. Nispel was, like, playing against me. And we had like some good like back and forths. Pretty sure that guy is a pretty dedicated TV player. Twenty four seven railway, yeah. There's twenty four seven railway players. There's twenty four seven lockers players. Like, if you enjoy the map, you enjoy the map, right? And this map is like pretty good in my opinion. It's like a better Heinem Resort, and Heinem Resort was an awesome map in BF4, so... Like, the inside area of this map for infantry is so much more playable than the inside of Heinem for me. More interesting and everything. Let's check out this side. Oops, there's one guy out there, but too far away. Where's this thing? Up here? Oh, I'm not going to bother angering him. Yeah, it's not. No. Nah. Well, I remember all the tank, the tank sweats back in BF4. Like, so the the jet guys and the boat guys were on the Parasol server. The tank guys were on the twenty four seven Zavod server. Infantry players on the twenty four seven Locker server. Like, twenty four seven of one map isn't actually that bad if you like the map. Kill bro. <laughs> Error edges out the kill race. Congratulations, Error 96, mate. Kill race! <laughs> Alright, maybe we end it there. Maybe we end it there, guys. I think we're gonna call it.